you here today to... <sighs> Sorry I'm late, Headmaster Crane. I was playing Orbo and... Not to worry. You're here now. Please join us. Today you will not be flying into space. Instead, your assignment will be to look closely at our home planet and learn a little bit more about it. Awesome! Uh, what are we looking at? Not just looking, Raven, but using all your senses. Paying attention to all you see and hear and smell on a remote island. Cool. When do we go? You are not going, Eagle. You and Robin will do your observing right here at Mission Control. Great! Uh -huh. But your job is just as important as being out in the field. You two will study all the information being sent back from the island by Hawk and Raven. Ooh! Yeah, uh-huh. That's what I'm talking about. Um, sorry, Eagle. Tell us more about this remote island, Headmaster. It is a place that can tell us a great deal about our planet, because it is also the site of a dormant volcano. Volcano? Aren't they dangerous? Live volcanoes are dangerous. This one is a dormant volcano, Hawk. Think of it as though it's asleep. You see, we live on the surface, also called the crust of planet Earth. On the surface, the Earth is cool, but inside it is very hot. Like a toasted marshmallow? Yes, a little bit like that. And sometimes the hot, melted rock on the inside comes up through the crust. This hot, molten rock is called lava. When it cools down, it becomes solid rock again. Where this happens, we call it a volcano. And when it happens, we call it an eruption. How do you know when a volcano is going to erupt? You can feel the ground shaking beneath you. You can hear it, too. And you can smell gas coming out of the ground and feel that it's hot? That's right. And when a volcano starts to erupt, it pours out a cloud of black ash. You would be able to see that from quite some distance away. So now we know what to look for. Let's go. Yes. Hawk and Raven, you may go and prepare for your task. And don't forget, you'll have Eagle and Robin at mission control, keeping an eye on everything that is happening. Wow, Eagle! The geographical history of the island is fascinating! How are you coming along? Bored. I wish I was on my way to the island. Look! There it is! Wow! Kind of different from Stardust Bay, huh? Yeah! Come on! Let's go explore! Wait! Shouldn't we take a moment to collect some information and send our findings back to Eagle and Robin? Sure, why don't you do that? Um, okay. Robin, we're at the island. Just collecting some samples now. The data should be sent over to you any minute. Thanks, Hawk. I'll keep an eye on the data stream. I'll set up some cameras, too. Team Stardust Star Striker is position of the orb. He moves to the left, he ducks to the right, he dummies the defender, and bam, he shoots, he scores! And the crowd goes wild! He go, he go! <sighs> okay, I set up the camera so Eagle and Robin can be our eyes and ears while we. <laughs> hey, Raven, do you smell something funny? Like gas? Hawk, come see this. Huh? What is that? Looks like some kind of factory. Isn't that Vulture? Yeah, and Dodo. And it 
Looks like they're making something down there. What are they... Whoa! Did you feel that? Yes. What is it? Smell of gas? Check. I think. Sound of rumbling? Check. Feel the ground shaking? Whoa! And check. Hmm. I've been studying all the information that Hawk is sending back, and something's come up. Have you seen anything on the monitors? Isn't this cool? I've been practicing this move and I finally got it! Eagle, you're supposed to be looking at the camera feed. Oh no, I don't think that volcano is dormant anymore. No way, are you sure? That's what it looks like. According to all this information, the volcano is waking up. Robin, you must share your findings with Hawk and Raven. Yes, sir. I'll try to reach them. Headmaster, should I fly out to the island to help out? No, Eagle. Your job was to study the monitors and report any unusual activity. But you seem to have been focusing on other things instead. I'm sorry, but I can make up for it if you give me a chance. You must learn how to look and listen. A space racer cannot just fly off into every situation. I will go to them and ensure their safe return. What are you cadets doing here? Headmaster Crane sent us to the island on an observation task. Oh, did he now? Uh-huh. Hey, what's going on down here anyway? Uh, nothing. We're just, uh, vacationing on this nice, warm, sunny, tropical island. And while we're here, we're making fuel in Mr. Vulture's top secret factory. The sweetest, tastiest fuel in the whole solar system. <laughs> What Dodo meant to say was, uh, uh, that is, um... But why build a factory inside a volcano? Can't you feel it rumbling and shaking? And the ground is kind of warm. Now, now, there have been rumblings down here for years. It's nothing. <laughs> this volcano is dormant. Besides, the hot steam cooks up the ingredients of our fuel. It's the perfect system. Isn't that what you always say, boss? Hawk? Raven? We've been studying the island, and I don't think the volcano is dormant anymore. Copy that, Robin. Then that explains the smell of gas, and the rumbling, and the shaking! And that! <laughs> the volcano's gonna erupt! We gotta get out of here! Wait for me! And just where do you think you're going? Rumbling, shaking, smoke. Gotta get away before the volcano blows up. Not until we pack up all this factory equipment, Dodo, and get those vats of sweet sugar fuel out of here. Okay, you're right, boss. We've gotta be brave. <laughs> the volcano! It's erupting! <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? My engine feels all gummy. Mine too. It must be the ash from the volcano. Yeah. <laughs> ah, <it's> falling! <laughs> Headmaster Crane! Hawk, Raven, thank goodness you're both okay. We're fine, but Vulture and Dodo are still down on the island. Yeah, Vulture had a secret factory inside the volcano. They were making some kind of sweet fuel drink. The fuel that contains too much sugar. No wonder he was making it in secret. Oh, that vulture, he's tried this before. Those super sweet fuels are bad for our engines, so we've banned them from the cafeteria. But did he not observe that the volcano was about to erupt? I think he didn't know, or he just chose to ignore all the signs. Where is Vulture now? We saw them try to fly out through the ash cloud, and, well, didn't see what happened after that. You cadets wait for me here. I'm going down there. That one was close, boss! And that one was even closer! Headmaster Crane, I can see you on the monitors. Yes, Cadet Eagle, what is it? There's a lava stream heading toward the beach. Copy that, I see it too. We've got an idea, Headmaster. Look to your right. Do you see a large rock there? Like a giant Orbo orb? Yes, I see it. According to Robin's calculations, if you push it, that'll send the lava in another direction while you help Vulture and Dodo. Thank you. I'm on it. It worked! Good thinking, Eagle. But it's not going to 
gonna hold that lava for long. Let's hope Headmaster Crane can get the Vulture and Dodo in time! Hooray! We're safe! We're safe! But my factory! My fuel supplies! They'll all be lost! It's too late for that now. Come on, boss! My top secret island factory! Ruined! You have only yourself to blame, Vulture. Yeah, and you should have paid better attention. Things didn't look, smell, sound, or feel right down there. Exactly. Put all those warning signs together, and you would have understood that sooner or later, that volcano was going to erupt. Hawk! Raven! Thank goodness you're okay! You were right, Headmaster. Research is just as important as being out in the field, and just as exciting. You did an excellent job, team. You have earned some downtime. So now is it the right time for a game of Orbo? Yes, Eagle. I believe it is. <laughs>